All right, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Tower of God episode 13. This is the finale, I believe, and I'm very looking forward to it. Uh, if you see my last Tower of God video, Tower of God video, um, you know that I screwed up on the recording, so I didn't manage to get any of my voice while recording the episode. So there's no point in me uploading the episode, but I did upload like me explaining that and my thoughts, however much I could remember of what I said after the episode. So, yeah, that's not going to happen this time because I can see the audio levels on my monitor now. Also, the my setup behind me looks kind of different because I'm currently moving my desk around. I'm, but I've now got a monitor up here. Um, just so, I, so I, if you see me looking up instead of right, as per usual, that's because I'm looking at the levels and stuff like that. Um, and there's a mess over there, but I'm not letting you see that until I, it's all cleaned up. <laughs> so, yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the episode right now. Oh, what is going to happen now because of this? I can't believe she did that. What's over? Yeah. Come on, bam. Why is she like this? What is she... I don't care what her plan is. She's so... So selfish. Why is she like this? <sighs> Jeez. She did the same test. Yeah, he didn't have... Yeah. She was the so she was there then. That was a loud noise. You and me both, bro. Apparently so.
<laughs> Ball some of the stupidity. Oh my god. <laughs> She's such a bitch. She's so shallow and selfish. God. Oh yeah, and when did her bodyguard disappear? I forget. She disappeared and Rack was like, where did he go? Ooh. Can't believe that this has been her plan all along. Yeah, I hope it is. That really comes into light now, that... What she said. Wow. Mm. Oh, yeah. So she didn't even feel the pain, it just went to him. That makes so much sense. So she did, did she actually die there then? And she just got resurrected, she got that one chance with the bodyguard?
Did Bam even come on his own, though? Did he not just get teleported here, like? Did he not just get brought by the tower? Or what? Jesus, so selfish, man. Your dreams, your dreams, but like you don't need to step on someone like this. Someone who's done so much for you as well. Hmm. That's a shame, Bam. That really is. <laughs> I saw a lot of the comments on my last video saying, welcome to the fandom's I Hate Rachel Club. So I'm going to assume this isn't the end of Rachel, Rachel, Rachel being awful. And that kind of makes me feel good, because I'd rather not come to like this character, I think. I think this is just where she should be cut off, or like, not get any kind of redemption, in a sense. Because from the very beginning, she like, didn't even... The idea of killing Ban, like, the thought in her mind didn't even waver at all. She just went straight for, yeah, I need a weapon. So I don't even think she's worth it. I hope Bam comes to realise this too. All he needs is his friends, that's it. He doesn't need Rachel. Oh, poor dude. First girl he met. <laughs> Happens to be this witch. Ugh. She's so fake, man. To be treated like you're special. You were special to him, and look what you've done. Like, even if he gets to the top of the tower, even if he becomes the best of the best, he'd still be special to him, but look what you've done. And after all this, I think even if, like, she changed her mind about wanting to do this to Bam and wanted to join up with the squad and wanted to try and do the tower on her own to the best of her ability, I think the administrators or whoever would have taken this into consideration probably let her climb, but she's done this and shown her true colours and it's just, this is what she's like. So jealous. And he would have as well.
Oh god. That caught to black then. Yeah, she needs. She doesn't get any redemption. Fuck this. She had a chance. She had chances. She could have been different. Oh god. Oh god, where's Bam? Jesus. Oh. oh, even Rack. Even Rack is like that. He's in that state. Rachel wouldn't fucking dare, mate. Rachel doesn't give a shit. These are his friends. Walk just fine. I hate you. No, oh. Oh, can't believe this is this is what they're thinking. Look at this bitch. Ugh. She doesn't care. <laughs> oh. Hasn't he already climbed the tower though? Well, oh, now. What does that mean? Oh, my guy. Yeah. Kun has the suspicion. 
Yes, he was, you bitch. Ugh. I wonder how Bam's gonna come back now. I wonder how he's gonna come back now and what Rachel did to him. This is gonna be so interesting. And this is the finale as well, like... What is gonna happen? No, oh, please don't tell me you can't remember anything. Please tell me you remember what happened. Thank you. Hmm. Good. Oh. No fucking way. Holy fuck. Alright, so. There wasn't anything at the end about a confirmation of a season 2 or anything. But if I probably have a look after this video, maybe something will be announced from Crunchyroll or Webtoon. But wow, was that Bam at the end with the really long hair and that? I need to see that. I need to see the the trained up bam with I don't know the more nerves. We need to see like we need to see how he takes on Rachel now. What he's like of her. I assume seeing how he looked and seeing his hair and seeing this he actually looked taller as well. So like I assume this is gonna be a time skip. Which is kind of crazy to think about. Like, I don't... I didn't even consider how long they'd be doing these tests to climb the tower. I don't know. That's just mad. I'm so looking forward to seeing where it goes from here. Um, I'll be waiting on season two. I don't want to spoil myself by watching the reading the webtoon. Even though people are so, say it's so great, I understand that. But I don't want to spoil it for season two. I just want to wait. I hope that it'll be announced soon uh really enjoyed the series at times it seemed a bit slow at the very start but it has picked up and it do has gotten really really intriguing so yeah it's it's still f like fuck rachel squad it's like our squad's the only we the only squad we need we don't need rachel i loved that when con said i wish i i'd hope that i'd met bam before you had that I actually would have been brilliant like that would have been so much better of an outcome than what's happened now but I guess 
if it weren't for Rachel's selfishness, Bam wouldn't have probably wanted to climb the tower either. Whether or not that would have been changed if he'd met Korn, I don't know. Because Korn wants to climb the tower too, so maybe it would have, and maybe he would have came with Korn if he was there instead of Rachel. I don't know. Regardless, great season one. Can't wait for season two. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. Thank you guys so much for watching the series along with me. I really appreciate it. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.